Can you punish someone innocent to punish someone who's guilty? Oh, JT, it, it these was... moral questions. Out of all the facts I've said this year, what percent were true? Oh. Well, I mean, listen, if the balls did not droop, then I, your husband's got small balls. What can I tell you? <laughs> if the balls ain't a drooping. Newsflash lady. <laughs> Newsflash lady. <laughs> at ten, at 5,000 patrons, Danny's going to climb into a bear the, cage. Five, why did we lower this? All right, Hungover Dan, bring us in. Okay, here we go. Welcome back, everybody, to hey. the 2023 Picky Boys recap. We're doing the best moments that we thought of the year, this past year. And uh, Danny forgot his phone, so we'll see if he remembers the things that he wanted to put on. I'm fucking hung like a horse. Danny is hung like a horse today, dude. <laughs> hung, hung. Danny woke up like... like. <sighs> no, I, I literally woke up, and I, I just rolled out of bed and went right to my car. I needed a bacon, egg, and cheese to potentially survive. Danny, you do that every morning. I do not. <laughs> what is it's the it's difference? the first bacon, egg, and cheese I've bought in a week. The impossible is it is it um write in the comments first what your favorite moments were from the year and see mm -hmm. if we match it up fair enough mm -hmm. Makes you got sense. it all right give us your first one my, me there it is i'll do I'll my do. first <laughs> my, my first one I, I i had to look and check if it was even this year that's okay crazy that it's been a fucking long ass year mm -hmm. my first one is danny unicycles this is saying if you cannot get your seat short enough which i don't think it is that you shorten it with a pipe cutter what? Oh! <laughs> yeah. That's this Fantastic year? Fantastic video. Yeah. That can't be this year. I have That's that. That's this year. I have that. I have Danny Unicycles. I stole it from him. I have Danny Unicycles. Danny Unicycles. It's a fantastic video. I mean, just... I don't know what aligned that there were so many coins in my pocket. Oh, my God. That kind of come so comedically fell out when I fell. It was just perfect. You couldn't have scripted it better. I'm going to try to get Jason all the clips so he could splice them all in. But Danny Coins, Coins Gate was yeah. fantastic moment. If you watch the Danny Unicycles moment, when Danny falls, cartoonally, I don't know if that's a word, a bunch of sonic rings fall out of his pocket like he just yeah, died. Like he took damage. Yeah, like he died <laughs> in a video game. And people thought that it was so funny and couldn't have possibly have been real that I CGI'd CG CG the coins in. That the coins were After Effects. They were not. Danny just no, <laughs> punch it a was, pocket change. It was a fantastic video and so fantastic that it even drew some comments from, you know, well-regarded people in the space. I'm not doing like this. Like Tommy Unicycles. <laughs> I'm not doing this. I, I listen, I, I guess and for the, for the what they're saying. For the new people that have no idea what we're talking about, Danny, uh, for years, pretended that he could ride a unicycle until the, uh, the Patreon sent us one. And then we made a video of him. Uh, still pretending to try to ride it, and it it, it ended how nobody could have rode that unicycle. <laughs> ended how everyone expected. Yeah, another good moment from that is when you're, you're like, "Wait, it says here we have to cut the unicycle," <laughs> like, and then it just cuts to you guys sawing a unicycle in like, half. He had no like. You could tell he's never even put together a unicycle. <laughs> hey, I wouldn't expect that. <laughs> I, I also like when you go. I'm afraid it's gonna go through and puncture the tire, and then you go, "Don't worry about it." And then the next shot, it's just. <laughs> <laughs> Good video. Give it a watch and uh, then come back and tell me you love me. Oh, okay. okay. Um, I have the playing categories with an electric potato. <laughs> Stop, putting it on. Stop putting it on your dick, man. Why are you trying to shock your dick? <laughs> Oh, I love that video. I have playing categories with an electric potato. So, you know how we shock, we spice it up, we, we shock. We had a hot potato that makes noise, and at a certain amount of time, it just starts shocking. And Danny, Danny had a rough go of that video. Rough, rough go of that game. I'm not oh, good yeah. under pressure. No, not even, not even close, actually. But uh, and we did more on Patreon, and it was just it didn't get any better. I have that for my Patreon one. You do? But, no, yeah. that's all right. It's, it's for the Patreon video. I have uh, Danny trying to eat 100 White Castle burgers. Oh, I have that too. Throwing up White Castle burger mush all over his White Castle burgers, proceeding to eat another burger, followed quickly by him throwing up again. Every bite is really, really hard right Every now. Every bite I take. <laughs> 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 don't, 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 stop, 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 stop. <laughs> oh, my God. Your body's going to reject that. I don't think... <laughs> Yeah. yeah. It's, it's the very end of the video. It's a whole it's a great video in general, but the very end is is throw up burger, throw up again. 
that was probably one of the most disgusting ones because you know there's the eggnog i don't have the eggnog on here the eggnog's really close with, with with those types of videos but that one there was something just extra gross about it i think it was the smell of the burgers because eggnog it's vanilla-y those burgers were horrid it's also the it's also the consistency you know it's like I'll take throwing up eggnog any day of the week over throwing up something mushy. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Liquids over or solids. Hard. Are, you, are you okay? <laughs> are you going to sneeze? I'm good. I, I, oh, I, you're I, thinking about it? No, I'm, it's, it's kind of making me want to throw up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true. He's really hungover. I don't know bringing that up. Um, <laughs> my look. next one is... Yeah, I know this one. Pizza. Dave, me, us trying to steal Dave Portnoy's money. I have that as well. We went to the Pizza Fest. I was I was slandered on the front page of New York Magazine. That was rude. Uh, that I mean, you listen. That's the, 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 they say no press is bad press. Mm. No, they do say that. No, no press is bad press. Well, they say no all press, press is good. Yeah, press. yeah, yeah. But it's no, the same thing. No, no publicity is bad publicity. That's right. Because no press. Means there's no press. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can't like that. That would be bad press. No, it doesn't exist. You're putting a comma in between. It's like no press is good <laughs> press. No. The point. The point is, is that when you're on the cover, you gotta, you gotta flaunt it. For even, even if mm-hmm, they, I'm mm-hmm. the poster boy for Dave Portnoy Sausage Fest. Yeah, that's which good title for the article. Good, good, lie. good title for the article. I, I also like the, the the style of that video. You know, we tried to branch out a little bit. I thought it worked well. Absolutely. Sure. Absolutely. Not one pizzeria answered us until JT started picking up the phone. I True. know. So that was wild. I have the don't laugh challenge. You laugh, you drink with uh, Gabby, Chaz, Ooh. Danny, and Antonio. If you're going to laugh after every sentence, we're going to have a. We can't call. We can't uncall timeout. That's true. Okay. Bring it back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I didn't. Okay. All right. Let me catch up to you. And then... Bring it. <laughs> what are you doing? That was a good one. That was a good one. Uh, like, we had a little yeah. audience that were also laughing. Mm-hmm. And Gabby didn't understand the rules the entire time. Didn't matter the entire time. Also, I I could write a list of all these, and we could probably link them if you want to wanna watch them, right? We could link them in the description. Yeah, we can link them all. That one was tough. It was uh, whoever laughs has to take a shot, and first team to 10 shots loses. If your partner laughs, you both drink. It was rough. It was rough because we're not really good at holding in laughs. And it was the people in the background, the audience, yeah. hearing them snicker and like giggle. It was tough. It was tough. It's one of those things where when, when, when you can't laugh, everything becomes so much more funny so than funny. it should be. So funny. Yeah, it's such a weird thing of the human mind because that, yeah. that really fucking comes back to bite you sometimes. I know. You're not yeah. supposed to laugh and you can't help it. Do and you... then you're out awake and then you start laughing and yeah. then everybody gets upset. Hmm. I don't know if that's the same. <laughs> it's pretty much the same principle, at least. Do you think of a comedian who's just okay went up on stage and said, all right, this whole show, the goal is for you guys to not laugh. Do you think he would get more laughs? Do you think it's worth if, a shot? If his material was like so bad that it's good too, right? Yes. Yeah. So like I, he's just telling the worst jokes ever that, it, and it's kind of funny. Mm-hmm. I think if you t- you told everybody, I'll give you ten dollars if you can sit through this and not laugh, and there was some kind of laugh checker, I would. I think that would work. <laughs> no, once you put money on it, I'm not laughing. I'm not laughing. Once you put money on it, I'm not. It's got to be just social pressure. Yeah, social pressure is enough because it's not you. You want the barrier to be broken. Yeah. Now, once you put money on, I'll put a thousand dollars to each person if you don't laugh. No one's laughing. <laughs> I think I'd laugh. <laughs> I, it's not laughing. Is, is when you think about it, it's really not something you choose to do. It kind of is. It kind of is. I get. It really I, isn't. I, especially if if you get a good joke in there, like it's a, it's just a reaction. I, I get what you're saying. If someone said, Danny, you will win $1,000 if you go watch this whole 30-minute set and not laugh. You... I'd fucking teehee right in their this face. Is, this is ridiculous. <laughs> For a second ridiculous. of the special. I, tr- I try. I try. But I know I know, I know myself. Oh, that, that's good. I'm and glad. Everyone should know themselves a little bit more. JT? Um, I have episode 295, Danny explaining how he rides a bicycle. Mm. Yeah, that was mine. <laughs> that was mm. mine, too. That's a good one. Dude, how do you sit on a bike? I just sit your your the bones of your ass like your whatever those are called they they go on the widest seat of the bike 
And your ball, <laughs> ball. Each, each one of each one. If this was the front of the bike, this is the back of the bike. <laughs> each one of your balls sits like this. <laughs> there you go. That clip kind of blew up on Instagram, and he, he I got, he am, got something on your lip. I don't know what it is, but that needs to go away. <laughs> spit. Oh. And I am very upset that nobody, no professional bikers, cyclists. Weighed in on this important really. conversation. No. Like, come on, can we get a fucking stitch out here to save our lives? Yeah, we couldn't get any fitness uh, or biking influencers for that clip, but the owl clip, it, it was like fitness central. Every fitness influencer loves owls, I guess. I don't know what that was about. And I still stand by that statement that your testicles droop to either side, one on each side. There was some comment that said, I had my husband get on a bike naked. And what was the result? I can't remember. No, no. I know the Inc comment. Inconclusive? First of all, that comment had about 30 comments below it of woman going, how did it go? Tell us, please. Yeah. Send yeah. pics. Send pics. Well, I mean, listen, if the balls did not droop, then I, your husband's got small balls. What can I tell you? <laughs> if the balls ain't a drooping. Newsflash lady. <laughs> Newsflash lady. Uh, this might be a little bit. Um, uh, what are we doing oh, here? You just said it was yours. So I don't, you no, have of course I have one extra one, you fucking dopey dope. <laughs> Rope a dope, dope. <laughs> those, those, those glasses actually look good on you. Yeah, thanks. No, I'm fucking kidding. Um, <laughs> do you remember your first blowjob? You don't job? fucking have anything. Do you remember your first blowjob? Oh, did you gag <laughs> on it? <laughs> <laughs> fucking, I mean, you, fuck, you, don't, you don't remember your first blowjob? I do. How long did it take for the guy to come? <laughs> <laughs> that's what you're going to set him up yeah, with? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's uh, worth high five. No, my, my, my third one is, uh, is puppets. Fuck. Yeah. I think I, I, I truly think that is the pinnacle of our year. It, it, it executed so well. They look exactly like us. Mm -hmm. it, it's just it, it, it was just it was just great. You know when you see an Puppets. idea come to fruition, it was everything I could have ever wanted and more. I've always wanted puppets like that. I, I knew eventually. As, uh, yeah, they are. I knew eventually when we first started this that we will have puppets. I didn't know when, but the opportunity I guess just presented itself and now we have them forever you know that's true i'm not fixing any of them so that's the, those are the ones we got like neutering fixing, them yeah. saying just in case like if danny's puppet arm falls off that's uh, danny's armless that's yeah. that's how it's Chop off his arm in real life then yeah, make it match. yeah. Oh. that's the only way to fix it yeah well I, I i like that just the whole episode every episode with the puppet that's my favorite all right this might be cheating but i have the fact that we filmed Patreon Gold 200, 300, 400, and 500 this year. The registration, I can't, where, I don't even, where even is it? Where's, oh my god. Oh, I'm sorry. License saying. and registration, oh please. <laughs> I have a, you know, a group of friends, group of people that do this with me. I want to know if any of them's, you know, like shady, going to betray me or something. Ooh, that's a, that's a question. You like that question? Okay, that's an important card, because I'm going to go beat them up or something. Oh, no. <laughs> Wait till I leave. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. That's terrible. Very nervous. My car just got declined because they thought it was fraud. Yeah, I mean, it's not every day that you just get up and go to Atlantic City. That's kind of crazy. Also, crazy. if you want to see those, patreon.com slash pickyboys. Uh, I think tomorrow, right? This comes out the 31st. Tomorrow, the goal video 500 drops. So get in there right now. Pickyboys.com slash Patreon. It's a doozy. It's definitely a doozy. And then... Talk about growth. Talk about... True. Th 200, 300, 400, 500. Four Patreon goals. That's wild. Yeah. No? It's we got more to come. Unbelievable. That's Great wild. videos incoming. I guess There's actually one coming out tomorrow. Red or black. Danny's, lag Danny's lagging behind so a little bit. drive the point home. Danny's lagging behind a little bit. But isn't that wild? No? Yeah, that is crazy. That's so we have, we have Martin learning how to drive. We have the fortune teller. We have the birth simulator. The boys wear a pregnancy belly for a week, and then we give birth at the end. And five thousand dollars on red or black. That's wild. How many goal videos do you think we're gonna film next year? Hopefully, I mean, I'd hope even more. I'd hope like five or six. So we filmed four this year. Yeah, so five or six. I six, think. six would be nice. Filming yeah. six next year. A thousand patrons. Damn, we got tattoos then. Not as nice. These ones are not as nice. Every, almost every. I mean, listen. I understand we made the goals together. But almost every single one involves me doing something that I don't want to do. All his ideas. 
all his they were all his ideas. No, no, we have uh, so at we have picky moms coming on soon. Soon our moms are coming on after the ice bath. Yeah, my mom is petrified. Really? Yes. It's gonna be so funny. Yeah, the rest are really rewarding for the audience to watch. I think because. Danny really, gets really shot nervous. at with. I'm really nervous about the hockey one. Yeah, Danny gets shot at, but from a professional hockey player with hockey pucks or something. Yeah. <laughs> all right. I'm very nervous about that one. I barely know how to ice skate. First of all, where am I going to get pads? Uh, let's hope they provide it. If not, we'll just put some pillows. No. Yeah, we can do a makeshift. Yeah, situation. yeah, yeah. MacGyver yeah. it. We will not be doing a makeshift. <laughs> we'll just situation. put like a, a couch cushion on your chest. <laughs> it should be fine. I heard hockey pucks fucking hurt. You're not gonna. I, I think you're gonna see like the guy shooting the, at the goal, and you're not gonna get in the the ice ring. I mean, I'm, I simply have to. Simply have to, he says. Everybody, JT, you have any more, or is that your three? Oh, uh, that's my two. Yeah. All right, I got a couple more. If you want, if you want me to rattle them off, yeah, tell go. me what you think. Um, I have spicy, incoherent. Do you remember that? Yes. Like that was when we got a fresh bag of cheese balls, and we weren't used to the. We were used to the stale ones, and I was drooling from the mouth trying to get Danny to I think it was spicy and coherent too as in not safe for work also so it was just us like blow up you know yeah that was this year uh this that was so crazy 10 months ago to be exact no it's fucking looking back at the videos this year it's, it is crazy looking at anything in January it feels like two years ago also because it's so many <clears throat> especially on patreon patreon.com slash picket boys double plug we did the 31 days of October and 12 days of Christmas that's like I was almost 60. 50 videos in two months. What are we doing out here? We spoil it. You spoil it, you guys, you cuties. Oh, I have the great blind water Tatsé test. Oh, yes, the water Tatsé test. The water Tatsé test. Um, water taste test. Danny misspelled uh, taste in the thumbnail. That should probably be an honorable mention, too. I don't think we could possibly clip together all the times Danny's misspelled something. I think it would be actually an immeasurable job. Martin drinking milk is a good one as well. Martin drinking milk is really test. good. Danny thought he was about to drink a nice gulp of Voss water. Big, big shot of tequila. It was it was gr- cruel and unusual. I think that was one of our first couple million view clip, too, at eight, eight months ago. True. And the last one I have here, I'm sure there's a bunch of honorable mentions. I want to see all your comments, too. Oh, no, I have two more. Sorry. So technically, we didn't start Would You Rather in this year. It was a little bit before. But I have Would You Rather Part 2 on here with 8K views for a podcast. And that really started it as a series to me because mm-hmm. now it's part two and then there's part three, part four, part five, all the way up to part nine this year. Yeah, maybe ten. But yeah, would you rather? I think that was a big, big, fun little little thing we did. And yes. then the last one is... I like, the, I like the would you rather too, the one with the button. Press the, the button. button. Press the button if, which is like, would you rather kind of, basically. Mm-hmm. Yeah, some, some version of would you rathers. But then that came out and, you know, we usually put out a would you rather every month. That came out and everyone was like, oh, is there going to be would you rather this month? You know, we got a cute little series. <clears throat> and then the last one I have here is the grossest game of Plinko ever. I have Danny eating the raw chicken heart oh, in that God. video, which was, was one, of the, one of the funniest, <laughs> one of the funniest <laughs> punishments, I think. I've witnessed in person. Yeah, oh, dude. That was Yeah, I mean just terrible. Po- just poison us next time. <laughs> this these th- those are those are not suitable for human consumption. Danny, I know you're hungover. <laughs> Which <laughs> the sheer panic. I would have I mean if I just saw one I think I might have vomited. Oh. I I need to like vomit and shit and piss and oh. Danny, we have I, apple cider vinegar over there if you want to vomit immediately. Yeah, you want to take a shot of that? I don't. Just not. think about how it would taste. I do not. <laughs> Just think about how it would taste. And that's, yeah, that's all I got. We're his missing... nose is going to like start bleeding from all the, just <laughs> what's going on in his head. Like I'm 11? Yeah. Like I'm 11. <laughs> yeah, exactly <laughs> like, like you're 11. You're Except a... without any of the cool parts. <laughs> yeah. Just a hungover <laughs> man. Just a hungover man. <laughs> Actually, the, some could argue in every way, shape, and form the exact opposite of 11. <laughs> Actually, I, I like waffles. Uh, ba- basically. Yeah, every single way. He does like waffles. He does like waffles. I do. Any other honorable honorable mentions? <laughs> Let's try that one again. I'm, I want to. I want to hear JT's third. I don't know. I have I have the Patreon ones, which honestly, in my head, like the top three Patreon moments were even funnier. I think. Oh, look yeah. at that guy! Wow. Hot take. Hot take here. Oh, also, you know, I mean, I guess recency bias, but the 
18 Christmas presents, mm-hmm. Naughty or Nice finale was pretty fun. Oh, that yeah, absolutely. Good. Not the best not the best uh, moment for me in that video, but that was fun. I'm surprised you didn't say the... Because I, I left these out intentionally, because usually you cheat and just take the most popular ones. I'm surprised you didn't say the Basement Yard Gets Drunk, episode 300. Like, I don't usually do that. What is, this is the first time we've done this. <laughs> oh, that's not true. That's Wait, not true. We, best moments? Best moments? Not the first time we've done best moments. We did moments. one other thing where it was like, oh, name your favorite three videos right, that we've yeah. ever done. And he was like, oh, the one with the most views is the one I like the most. <laughs> it's cheating. Well, that's cheating. why he has the most views because it's the best he's one. He's a cheating bitch. He's cheating. Uh, <laughs> honorable mention, the caveman uh, caveman poetry with uh-huh. Joe uh-huh. Santa Babo. <laughs> you know his name. He's <laughs> <laughs> too hungover to say. Uh, no, that's a, that's a very good one. Also, every uh, Guess the Rotten Tomato score video is, is fucking... Those are my Ab- abysmal. And then I just saw because I'm scrolling through on Patreon, we did the uncut one an hour and a half. Jesus Christ, That's what was saying? JT had to stand for two hours. <laughs> <laughs> those <laughs> are my favorite. I think in the new year, we're gonna do more of those. Maybe even switch it up a little bit. What's What's that? Um, I'm yep. not. Should I give he, away? Surprised we didn't do a Christmas should movie one. one. Yeah, I know. We, it was just not enough time in the. Also, yeah. I think one. I think the. I'm making it. I'm speaking into existence right now. Video game we IGN gotta, ratings. We have to. We have, we have to, to do, do that. It. You oh, gotta man. do it. Video game IGN ratings. You gotta do it. What if we just do video games, but it's just my made up rating of what I think of the game? That was. We can't <laughs> I like do that. that. We can't. <laughs> Let's do that. do that. No, no. Actually, what we have. To oh, do, this one's a ten because I love it. No, no. What we have to do before that is get. You, Chaz, and Jason in the hot seat, and Let's because do it. because all they say is like, "Oh, you guys are so terrible at no, guessing." No, no, I don't say that. Score. I don't say that. Jason says that. That guy, that guy back there. <laughs> the next one <laughs> on, on Patreon, we're gonna do that. We'll, we'll get them in the hot seat, and we'll see we'll see how they like it. How about that? All right. And, and that seat is hot. And that seat is hot. And that's um, uh, that's. I mean, I'm sure there's many more. I still want to hear what they uh, everybody has to say, but I think. You know, Danny Mays, obviously. Oh, yes. The return of Danny Mays. The Mays brothers. The Mays brothers, true. And then that's it. How are we looking? uh, What do we want from 2024? I'm trying to bring big penile energy into 2024. Okay. BPE. You're going to do that? Yes. JT? Uh, probably big ball energy. Big ball energy. Big penis. So So you got big, we got big, big peen, big balls. So what do I have to bring then? Big, I don't asshole. Maybe why would that help? Why would that help? <laughs> How about you bring your big bussy? In? <laughs> you guys are a bunch of bad. What people. do you know? What do you want? What do you want for the new year? I want. Danny to take a shot of something right now. I, I want to see that, how th- that's not the awesome. new year. I want. Yeah, that's well, you think it'll be awesome? Yeah, that's two against one. L- l- what if I sing "Old Lang Syne" instead? Or all the acquaintance be forgot. I've never heard the title or the song itself. Yes, what did you yes, say? you have. It's the New Year song. Everybody fucking knows the song. I've never heard. Of, what is it? It's called Old Lang Sai. Never heard of that for Old sure. Lang- I'll t- I guarantee you that. <laughs> uh, now, I, how does it go? For all the acquaintance be forgot. Dun, 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 dun. It's the New Year song. You, you don't know the words, or is that the, is it supposed like, to hum? For old lang syne. <laughs> Never heard this. What the fuck? You've heard it. Have you ever? I have not. Have Leave in the comments if you haven't heard it either. At my last uh, New Year's party, I had uh, girls underneath the table eating frozen grapes. You see that trend? No. You had girls? I didn't like force anybody. I'm saying at the party there had Were these girls, were they consenting to this? (laughs) Eat the grapes! No, no, no. Yeah, apparently that was uh, to find true love in the year. You have to eat grapes under the table. I just just called them names and I said, no one's going to love you if you're eating grapes under a table. Oh, you know what we should do in 2024? I saw a TikTok that said that a peeled strawberry... Will change your life forever. That's ridiculous. What does that None of this mean? TikTok shit's true, what like ever. That, what does that mean? <laughs> well, you, you should watch this video. The man is talking about it sensually. And he's saying you peel a strawberry, I guess you cut off the seeds, and you put it in your mouth, and it's just the greatest strawberry you'll ever no. eat. Bro, these TikTok people, they're all frauds. I'm telling you. Though. You guys remember when we tried the TikTok trend as vodka through a Brita filter, and it tasted like Guess what? Vodka. You guys remember that? Honorable but, mention. I like that video. That's 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 but, true. And that was a great video. But <laughs> the point is that that, that trend's fake because everyone on TikTok tries it and goes, 
Oh my god, it's it's crazy. It didn't change fucking anything. Didn't but change think about anything. think about this. What is the worst part of a strawberry? All oh, those little fucking seeds. Uh, you they're really you don't notice them when you're oh, oh. Oh, you don't. Oh, Bevo oh, over here just just swallowing it. I would, if I could not taste, I would could tell what a, the strawberries in my mouth because of these fucking little seeds. I hate the seeds. I like strawberries. <laughs> <laughs> I hate them. I hate the seeds. Uh, I like strawberries, and not only is it way too much work to peel each individual strawberry. That's fair. Number two. Oh, yeah. Number two, you're like you're losing a lot of the strawberry when you do it too. Yeah, yeah, strawberries are also are already too tiny. Oh, you got a perfect peel? You're going to get just the skin? <laughs> oh, excuse me, Mr. Perfect Peel? <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying that, but this is obviously something that you do. It's an opulence, you know, thing. You know, it's like, I don't... I, that word is yeah, too big. Yeah, what is that? Come on. It, it's just like a, it's like a thing He doesn't know it either. He doesn't know what it means. <laughs> <You> know, <laughs> so it's like your waste... Like, you, I'm okay with wasting part of my strawberries because I, I got so many other fucking strawberries that I, I can peel them and disregard some of the, the fluff. Some of us are living in this economy <laughs> where, where fucking we can't just be throwing out half our strawberries every time we eat them. His definition of opulence was correct, by the way. That was the most surprising part of 2023. <laughs> <laughs> the most surprising moment happened on the last day. Yeah. Out of all the facts I've said this year, what percent were true? Oh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you 65, honestly. Woohoo! Whoa. Yeah. I'd so, I'd go, I was going to give a generous... 13. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. A, Come on. A generous 13%. <laughs> I still think he's right more than he's wrong. Oh. It's just like it's so he's wrong so much that, you know. It gets it swept out. away. Yeah. No, my real answer was going to be like 47. A little a little less than half. And Did, I think he's all right with that. I'll take that better. More over 13. <laughs> but I'm over 500. That's what makes the Danny fact so... And scary is because you could be right, could be wrong. Usually right. <laughs> don't don't start <laughs> don't start taking more points. What? Don't start taking extra points. All right. Dude, I have a I have something that's been bothering me all week. Uh oh. You guys ready? Okay. If a Siamese twin commits a crime, okay. what do you do? Or let's say a murder. If a Siamese twin commits a murder, do you send them to jail and the other guy with it? It with with him? Hmm. I think you have to fucking... You chop them chop and then them jail down. one? Jail I, one. I don't think that'll work. I think they both die. Like, if they're conjoined... They... Where, where, where are they conjoined? This they're is a huge... Full-on share this. organs. Yeah, so you can't cut them in but half. But each one controls half the body, and one, the one guy, on the right guy, guy on the right, was able to take a gun and pop someone. I think... Guy with the left tried to stop him, even. Oh, tried to stop him? Oh, yeah, him. tried to stop him. Went oh. Oh, like that. What are you doing? Oh, oh my no. goodness, this is a great question. It's like, do you, oh. can you punish someone innocent to punish someone who's guilty? Oh, JT, it, it these would, moral questions. It, it, it would be the equivalent of like, let's say I knew one of you guys committed a murder. I wasn't sure who, but I knew for sure it was one of you. So I just threw you both in jail. Mm. It's kind of messed up. It is. You can't, I don't think you can do that. Oh, no. But they also just can't be getting away with murder. They also can't get away with they it. They also, I mean, they can't get away with it either. Otherwise, this guy's a supervillain. No, we can never put him in jail and yeah. he can murder yeah. away. As long as he convinced his second head that to, to per, be innocent, he's immune to the law. That's not right either, though. I say you throw them both. Yeah? Toss them both. Sorry, head. You're already, you already in a messed up situation. That's, that is an impossible situation. I don't know what to do. I really don't. I so, think you, that well, uh, there was never a case like that. I'm it sure. has happened. What? It wasn't, what? It, wasn't, what? It, wasn't, it wasn't murder. It wasn't murder. <laughs> but are you ready? So Chang and Ang Bunker, twins that the twins that gave us the term Siamese twins were caught in exactly this situation. Chang was a bit of a drinker and got violent regularly <laughs> and was once arrested for punching a guy. The judge eventually ruled that he couldn't jail the innocent. So he let them both go. So they were immune. Wow, they yeah. got a pass. But, you know, for punching a guy, maybe it'd be different for murder. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I think that it might Wait, be the same. Can they get... Here we if go. you drink, which who gets drunk? Do you both get drunk? I think it depends if you share... Oh, no, you definitely both get drunk. Like, what if you do heroin? Because like the blood is shared. drug. I think if the if one head can't convince the other head to not do heroin, then they're both doing heroin, it seems. Yeah, that's weird how they said he's a drinker, because... 
if he's a drinker, you're a drinker too, buddy. Yeah. You share I'm a bloodstream. I'm actually sober. <laughs> <laughs> he's fucking wasted. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't drank in 20 years. <laughs> Technically, a, a sip of alcohol has not touched my lips. They're driving. They're driving. He's like, no, let have him blow into it. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know. That's been bugging me. How do you find these things? That's been bugging me for a week. I don't know the answer. Murder is tough. If it ever happened, I would watch that court case. Oh, the court case. Oh it's, my god. It's gonna be it's gonna move up the courts to the Supreme Court, undoubtedly. And the, even those guys are gonna be like, what the fuck do we do? <laughs> they, like once once they're in front uh, done being all proper, they go to the back room's like, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> you know? Okay, eight years Nef- of law school, nothing could prepare me for this. Yeah. The Netflix documentary would go crazy. Oh, five episodes. Conjoined justice or something like that. <laughs> Disjointed oh, yeah. court or something. I think uh-huh. I think first first thing we're looking into is can we split these Two apart. No. Nah. There's no That's way. the first thing we got to look If you could, they would have done it already. Yeah, like, that's, that's if, you're, if you're conjoined at the hip, yeah, probably. But, I mean, if you're sharing organs, there's no way. Oh, my God. Also, when one of them dies, the other one always dies, like, an hour later. Well, yeah. How does one of them... How does... Oh, I don't, I don't if even they, want to If they have separate that. brains, you know, they can die at different times. Oh, ugh. That's, that's bad. Separate hearts, even? Do you, what, how do you... Imagine, but that would be... That's the worst case scenario. How about the casket would be very strange? Just one guy's alive and one guy's just oh, dead. Oh, now you're talking about burying his guy. wake. Yeah, his wake. That is <laughs> morbid, Dan, to end out the year. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> God damn. I'm sorry. I just that's what I'm thinking about, and I think it would kind of uh, shrivel up, right? This It'd is just fall off like a skin tag or something. I don't think you know what conjoint it is. Now that I, I'm thinking I'm, about it, I'm I'm starting to question that as well. I also, for a second, the half the time we were talking about this, thought it was Siamese. Like the cat? It is. It is. Oh. Wait, what? What did you think? What do you think I was what saying? What did you think it was different? Isn't a Siamese cat just bald? No, well, I mean, that's a totally different thing. I don't know why. Siamese cat is a thing, and then Siamese twins are a thing. There's really no relation. So why the fuck did they call it a Siamese cat? I don't I don't know why they called either, either. Also, Siamese sounds like a dirty word. Like, yeah, you're not supposed to say it. Siamese. Look at these. <laughs> yeah. Siamese nuts in your mouth. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. You think they're going to fall yeah, for that? He, no way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got him. I you got wanted you. a high five. You didn't yeah, get nothing. Yeah, yeah, okay. You we got know the you're high five, you fucking douche. Trying to pull up. Too fast. Or no, too, too slow. slow. <laughs> <laughs> he was too fast, I though. was too fast. He happened. Danny Speed Moriarty is what they call him. That's very true. Danny's dying out here. That should be our question of the day, Danny. What's the worst hangover Siamese you ever thing. Oh, the Siamese, oh, okay. Siamese thing. What's uh? Is this one of your worst hangovers? No. What's the worst? The worst hangover was um, of the day we shot a video with Ahmed. Oh yeah. After uh, Joe Sapi Labo's. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Are you messing? Why up? No, after, after Joe Santagato's thirtieth birthday party. Mm. Or was that? Mm. I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he also, at 4 a.m. 31st, I think, actually. There, I think, I don't know. But at 4 a.m., Danny also had just five dozen pickled eggs, pickled hard-boiled eggs at this bar. It was it was so bad, and I was shopping the morning after for, like, a video we were doing, and I was getting all this gross stuff. And on the ride home, I like stopped on the highway. I pulled over on the shoulder of the highway because I was gonna vomit. Damn, it was really bad. That's Damn. bad. It was oh, bad. Yeah, Ahmed was. I wonder if Ahmed remembers that. Ahmed was filming some video, and Danny was just like, "I saw Danny just like this, pretty much where I'm sitting." And then as soon as we were done filming, Danny got up to run and didn't make it and threw up the whole way. <laughs> Ahmed just started clapping. He's like, "Get it all out, brother! Get it all out, brother!" Also, the first time I ever drank wine, mm. uh, like ten bottles of wine. It, the, that morning, it was like D-Day. Like I had like a ringing in my ears. Wine, wine, wine will definitely do that. My worst hangover is also wine. Mine too, I think. At yeah. the end of the night, wine at the end of the night will get you. And I, that's uh, unfortunate too, because I love a good wine nowadays. Well, I mean, you could still have wine. It's when you have four 30. gallons of <laughs> yeah. wine, and it's when you have shitty wine. What was the worst hangover you've ever had? Uh, not crazy. Just college. I think open bar. And it's one of those open bars where you could get unlimited wine, which at the time I thought was awesome because it's like, oh, I could have beer or I could have wine, which is, what is wine, like 10%, 12%? Yeah. Nine, nine to 13, yeah, I guess. So, I, and I was just drinking that all night, and then I went, 
the next morning and went, oh, okay. Now I know why everyone else wasn't on the same track as me. Because of the wine. No, now I know why no one else was fucking downing wine over and over instead oh, of just downing beer. You learned the hard way. Gotcha, gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Another thing that happened this year is that, so sometimes when me and Danny meet someone for the first time and we just, they, they ask too many questions or just, you know, just tr- purely curious questions, we'll just riff. So like, you know, Danny was in the, the house and he was living here and I was like, oh yeah, he's my brother, yada, yada, yada stepbrother or whatever. And for a year, I think for this whole year, Keith and Ahmed <laughs> legitimately like thought that me and Danny were br- brothers, like actual brothers. I can see it. Or actual brothers. And then different in the, dads. And then in the car, oh, for sure, different dads. And then in the car, on uh, I was driving with Keith, and you know, we just randomly, I, I, I forgot that a year ago we, we, get, we gave this little fib, and I said, you know, something like, oh yeah, Danny and his mom or something. He's like, oh yeah, so which, which parent is both of yours? And Keith said that. I went, <laughs> I went, what? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> he, he goes, if you forgot the brother thing, that's so strange <laughs> yeah, to hear. Like, yeah. Yeah. He goes, which which parent is the same with you and Danny? Like, how are you guys brothers? I went, what the fuck are you talking about, Keith? He said, we're not brothers. And Keith, like, you saw on his face his whole world kind of shatter. And I was like, Keith, no, we were fucking with you, dude. And he's like, for a whole year, I told Ahmed that. And it's like, you know. That's funny. And Ahmed was heartbroken. And that happened this year as well. So Danny lost the brother this year. The truth is, let's make 2024 a great, great year. 2023, what would you rate it? Oh, pretty dog shit, Pretty honestly. dog shit, yeah. <laughs> yeah, dog shit. Uh, yeah, but, uh, you know, I'd say uh, it's four and a half. Four and a half, okay. There have been better years then. 1,000, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, four and a half out of ten. A lot of good things happened. A lot of not good things happened. Um, and, you know, I think I'll overall, I, l- I like the uh, the content we put out. I think the Picky Boys 2023 was a 10 out of 10. Oh, that's hard to beat. Hard to beat a 10 out of 10. You're right. It was 9.5. Point- Six out of ten. Okay, I like the, I like the, the room, room to breathe. Have room for improvement. Room to breathe there. I like the room yes. to breathe. Um, and I think next year is going to be even better. Nine point seven. Nine point seven. What happens once once we reach ten? Then maybe we should just quit. You think just quit while you're ahead? Fair. Yeah, that's fair. So we got you, you have four you don't years. Jump the shark and then start going down. <sighs> ten thousand patrons. Danny jumps the shark. <laughs> <laughs> and then we just patrons, we're all going in a fucking one of those cages. Yeah, you can suck my little balls. <laughs> no, we'll do that at 1500. Oh, come on. You wouldn't do that? I think we already have goals up to then. Oh, no, we don't actually. You wouldn't do that? A cage, man? You'd be fine. There's only like three videos of out there of like a shark getting in the cage. I know, but there's many movies of the cage snapping and dropping to the bottom, though. Wouldn't want to do all that. How about this one where I saw where you can be in a glass box nope. at a grizzly bear exhibit? <laughs> nope. Oh, I'd much rather the shark for sure. Much rather. Um, Isn't it the same level of danger? No, the shark. The shark one has to be more danger because you're underwater. Also, underwater, and there is like holes. There's the same thing with the glass box with an, uh, alligators too. I've seen them. I've seen all three. How do you? Wouldn't it be so great if bears were like friendly? Because they just look so so cuddly and fun. True. Yeah, but I also think that, you know, I you always hear, oh, bear is stronger, bigger, and worse, and more deadly than you, you even imagine. And they must be right, because I don't consider them that bad. So I, I know I'm wrong. And to see a, a fully grown one up close, I'd probably not not be okay with that either. And they'll just, they don't even want to eat it either. They just kill you for fun. I don't think that's Not right. Fun, but I don't think that's right. I don't think they put on little hats and they they start <laughs> going into camps. No, but they uh they, yeah they do not they do not want to eat you. At ten thousand patrons, we put Danny in a. In I a, refuse. Ten ten thousand patrons, well, you listen, do it, listen, listen, and you, and you get the whole month's worth of Patreon that's, revenue. That's nice. That's <laughs> it's nice. It's nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. Well, it's a little money nice. to sell it to. That's him. nice. Well, that's we'll, nice. We'll, we'll look into it. <laughs> 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 You're such a cheap bitch. I feel like for some reason I have to be covered in peanut butter. Why? I don't know. <laughs> honey, honey, maybe. Honey, honey, honey. <laughs> honey. No, I mean that would be I, th- shitting myself is like a real possibility there, and then that would be even worse because now I'm like flipping around in this <laughs> shit box, and honey and, and shit, I'm covered in honey. <laughs> it's just it's just a bad idea the audio, all around. The audio. 
is gonna be the most unusable foot like audio yeah. that we've ever had. Also, like, I don't know. I just it's just again, if I died during that, then it's just all my fault. <laughs> it's all your fault, actually. <laughs> it's all my fault, and everybody can call me stupid, and they're justified. <laughs> I wouldn't let you die in that box. But I would do that over bungee jumping. <laughs> that ten, is, that's insane. Ten times out of ten. That is so crazy. Let's of ten thousand patrons will look into it. At ten, th- at five thousand patrons, Danny's gonna climb into a bear no, cage. Five, why did we lower this? Two thousand patrons. You said, what t- we you said ten thousand, <laughs> and 10, I get the months. I said we. I, I said we'll talk about that part. <laughs> and I get the months Patreon money. You can take the. Whatever the cost of this is. Out of it? Oh, thank you, Gracious yeah, yeah, Man. Yeah, yeah. Thank you me. can take the cost. You can take the production cost out of it. I don't know how much they charge you. They probably just, fuck, I don't know. Just hand them oh, a couple. It's, it's got to be a few They should thousand. give you a fucking psych evaluation. Bear glass cage experience. Yeah, now we have to look if it's. Dude, that would be like, JT. That would be, I think, the funniest thing. We've ever done. Yeah. I think any, arguably anybody's ever done. Yeah. He's perfect for it. Too. He's perfect. He's, He's so perfectly primed perfect. for it. All right, 2024, we're getting to 10,000 patrons, and Danny's going to climb into a glass box with a, <laughs> with a bear. You excited? No. I, I'm really... Nuts. I'm sure it's safe. It's fine. It, it'll be fun, I guess, ish. It'll be, it'll be completely... We'll solder you in there. That's even worse. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. What if I have a heart attack in there? I don't think anyone's getting through the bear fast enough anyway. This is not good. <laughs> this is just not good. Well, everyone has a friend, and ten, and we could get to 10,000 in a month if we try, if everyone tried as hard as they possibly can. And look at the excitement on this guy's face. <sighs> Why these lofty goals? What did fucking <laughs> Joe and Frank do for 10,000? Uh, Frank got waxed. Well, he's getting off easy. <laughs> what the hell is this? You got, you got to, you, you're the one that said it. We're going fucking, into a bear. They just you know, fucking wax my asshole. Fine. Are, are you no that, bear cages. Are you that hairy? I mean, I'm sure some some would stuff would come off. <laughs> what on earth? <laughs> what on earth did uh, that like, mean? Yeah, a, a little. I, I mean, I, I I don't fucking look often. I don't know. <laughs> Definitely a hair too. Three, so you look every four, once in a while. Ten. Yeah. Yeah, you ever do like a mirror? Like, Our mirror is not low enough for oh, that. You have to have a hand mirror for oh, this. Okay. You don't of own course. a hand mirror. Yes, I own a no, hand mirror. No, you don't. I own a hand mirror. No, you do not. Yes, I do. No, 10 bucks if you get a hand mirror here in the next 30 <laughs> yeah, seconds. If you can get a, the next 30 yeah, seconds. If you can get a hand mirror here in 30 seconds, I'll give you $10. I can't. I know. <laughs> no, we can't. All right, we're getting out of here. JT, tell them where to find you. You can find me on Instagram at the Balls. You can find me at Danny is watching on Instagram. Please follow me. <laughs> what? <laughs> nothing, nothing. What? No, I it's agree. That's a fucking plug. <laughs> I agree. I agree. You can find me at Aunt Prisco on Instagram. Can't forget to follow. The Picky Boys. Everything will be in the description. Jason. <laughs> Jason's going to yell at him. Right. Happy New Year, everybody.